Hello everyone, in this video you will learn how to identify the nerves in the upper limb. So if we look here, this area you see a mesh, okay? And if you go and you watch the video for station one, you learn that this mesh will give you the delimitation from where you have a cord and then after the mesh you have nerves. So all the nerves will be labeled after the mesh, okay? Before we have the cords. And in case you are interested, this would be here the posterior cord. This one right here is the medial cord. And this one is the lateral cord. Now looking at the nerves, which is part of your terminology list. This nerve that you see here that goes around, wraps around and reappears here, this is the axillary nerve. This nerve that you see going down here and keeps going down on the ulna side, this is the ulnar nerve. This nerve that goes down in the middle is the median nerve. And you remember that you have a median nerve because median ends with the letter N and nerve starts with the letter N. If you write medial nerve is wrong. You need to say median nerve. This nerve that you see here, it continues underneath the biceps and on top of the brachialis muscle. So this nerve that starts here and goes all the way down and it stops on top of the brachialis. This is the musculocutaneous nerve. Musculocutaneous nerve. And that's why every time you say this, I tell you to go in your arm, you go and you grab your biceps like this and you say musculocutaneous nerve, musculocutaneous nerve, because all the sensation you have here when you touch your biceps is because of the musculocutaneous nerve. So that's one way you can remember that the musculocutaneous nerve is this nerve you have stopping on top of the brachialis muscle. Now, you see this nerve right here? This is the radial nerve. The radial nerve has two branches. You have the superficial branch of the radial nerve and you have the deep branch of the radial nerve. This here is the superficial branch of the radial nerve. And this one that stops and goes deep into your forearm and reappears right here. This is the deep branch of the radial nerve. Okay? So, I will show you soon how you identify the radial nerve easily if you are the nerve. If you are the nerve and you're right here and I tell you, go superficial, the only way you have to go is you keep going down on the side of the radius. But if you are the radial nerve and I tell you go deep, your only option is to go deep and then you go into your forearm basically and you reappear posteriorly right here. That's why this is the deep branch of the radial nerve and this is the superficial branch of the radial nerve.